The Ghana Revenue Authority Commissioner General, Amisha Dai Owusu Amwa, indicated that the digitization drive for domestic tax and customs division will continue unabated, where the next phase of ECOMS and the taxpayer portal would be deployed. He highlighted the piloting of e-commerce, gaming and bet taxes, among other strategies to enhance revenue mobilization. We will, once we get the approval from Parliament, implement the e-levy and we will carry out massive education and garner support as much as possible to ensure that it is successful in the country. We are also conscious of the VAT, and I've also heard people talk about that, and I also want to announce that by 1st April, we will start piloting uh, v electronic uh, VAT, or electronic invoicing. And we have already selected a number of uh, taxpayers, about 100 of them, who will be part of the piloting. The Deputy Finance Minister, Abena Osei Asari entreated the GRA to undertake staff capacity building and leverage digital space to achieve revenue targets. Toby Chair, the exigencies of our current situation, high youth unemployment, limited fiscal space, and a global pandemic, demand our regional authority is what is positioned to deliver prompt, convenient, and responsive service of the highest quality. To do this, we believe that these two fundamental principles must guide you. One is empowering our GRE staff to work to high standards and full accountability. And then two is leveraging digital tools to realize operational efficiencies. I believe these principles will cause a fundamental shift in the perception of GRE staff. The Volta Regional Minister, Dr. Ashibo Lecha, implored GRA to explore all measures towards attaining the Ghana Beyond Aid mantra. As we all know, economies the world over have not been the same since COVID-19 appeared. In spite of these challenges, we are determined as a country to be self-reliant without heavily relying on the continuous support from the World Bank, IMF, and other donor partners. Togwe Chairman, for government to attain its goal of Ghana Beyond Aid, authority must use all available means to mobilize the needed revenue to fund the provision of infrastructure, such as hospitals, portable water, and all other amenities needed to make the lives of our citizens better. Fred Kwame Asai, Joy News, who...